So I'm about to do the runaway mountain coaster here in Branson. Not quite dark yet, but they do have some lights on it. I heard this one has a really good light package at night. So, Dad, you gonna go on it? I don't know. <laughs> Okay, that one was a bit crazy. That one is definitely crazier than the Branson coaster. So yeah, if you want a really intense mountain coaster, the runaway mountain coaster on kind of the southwest side of Branson. Although I've only done two mountain coasters, so maybe this one isn't that intense, but compared to the Branson coaster it is. Towards the end there, it gets kind of crazy. But it's pretty cool too. This is the last part of the Runaway Mountain Alpine Coaster. This is where it gets crazy. And the night ride on this is really cool with it all lit up like this. It's not completely dark out here yet, but when you're on the track, it definitely seems definitely seems completely dark, except, of course, all the lights. And it is really fun. I was able to go down without braking. It's definitely an intense ride. A lot of fun. I see someone on the course right now. Yeah, that part up there that we can see, that's where it gets a little intimidating. Because you're coming out over the edge and you see you see the big drop off as you're about to take that turn. That could be a freaky point on it.